Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my updated summer foundation routine. Um, most of the products have changed besides one, I believe, and I don't even think I did a summer foundation routine last year, I'm not really sure. But um, this is going to be it, and um, I actually have it on right now, so you can kind of compare the two if you want to. So, um, yep, that is really it if you want to see how I do my foundation pretty much. I'm going to be honest, I don't wear foundation all the time. It's not really good for your skin at such a young age. So I don't really wear make, like foundation a lot. And plus, I'm really lazy in the mornings. Um, so, um, but this, if I do wear foundation, this is pretty much the routine I go to to get to it. Or, like, get through it. So, um, yeah, if you want to know how I do this, keep watching. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is prime my face. Now, I'm going to be completely honest, most of the time I really don't prime my face, but when I know that I'm going to be wearing my foundation all day and I'm going to be out a lot and like, you know, just, you know, you want it to stay on. So primer is always a really good choice, um, but like I said, honestly, I don't wear it all the time. It just kind of depends on what I'm doing for the day, but when I'm going out and, um, like going shopping or something that's pretty much all day. I usually put a face primer on so that my foundation doesn't smudge and stuff. One that I use is from Raw Skincare and it is the Androba Botanical Face Primer. And it smells like oranges. I think it smells so good. I just use one pump of it, which is like this much. So it's not that much at all. Alright. Now I'm going to apply concealer, and the one that I use is the CoverGirl Invisible Concealer, but the um, label has worn away from me, like, twisting it open and stuff. But um, this is in Fair, and I use this for mostly under eyes. And for some reason, I have really bad under eye circles this morning, so, you know, you and then just some on your problem spots. I have one right there, and then a couple right here. I think that's really all that are really visible. Yeah, okay. And then what I do is I just use my finger and I just pat that in. And this concealer is like lighter than my actual skin tone, which I think is what you're supposed to do actually. So just like that. Then I'm going to take either foundation that I'm going to use for the day. I'm going to be using either foundation that I use for the day. Today, since I want more of like a light foundation, I'm going to be using the Pure Makeup by Maybelline. And this is almost out for me. Like you can kind of see it. Yeah, it's almost out. So I'm just going to shake that up. And sorry, my chair is like clanking against the wall. So. Alright, just make sure that that's really good and shaken up. So, I'm going to be using my Pure Makeup by Maybelline, and this is in Classic Ivory. And what I do is I just put this on the back of my hand, just like that, and that's pretty much all I use. And I use this foundation brush, and... And I'm just going to put this on my skin, obviously. My forehead... Get under those eyes. Now, I like to do is just brush it on, and then I like to take my hands and just rub it in so that I know I get it really rubbed in and it's not going to be streaky. Alright, so just like that. Then what I do is I take a powder, it can be pressed powder, loose powder. Um, for this I'm going to be using my loose powder and I got this like a week ago. This is like my new favorite product. Um, and it is the All May Wake Up Hydrating Makeup and pretty much this feels like water going onto your skin so it kind of reminds me of summer so I think it would be a good summer product. So, yeah. so I'm just going to push this little brush in. Alright, and then I'm just going to buff this into my skin. Then 
Then I just continue with blush and bronzing and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I'm just going to like stick to my basic kind of routine of things that I use every day because I switch up my br blush. I switch up my blush and bronzer and stuff a lot. So, yep, that is pretty much it. Stay tuned for new videos and I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye.